it's Daya and we are back for part 2. I am going to color, shade, and finish the line art that I made in part 1 of this Princess Zelda from the upcoming Super Smash Brothers for the Switch, uh, Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Um, if you didn't see part 1, it's just the line art portion, so if you didn't see it and want to, feel free to go back. Um, and uh, this is another <laughs> unscripted ramble. So if you would like, feel free to mute my arse and set the um, <laughs> video to some music, <laughs> sorry. Uh, but yeah, so anyway, um, I started off with the base coloring and then, um, you know, I did a little bit of like pre-shading and then I did the, you know, more detailed shading. There isn't as much to talk about on the artwork itself because unlike the line art where I <laughs> had a little bit of struggles that I could talk about, I didn't really have too many problems with the coloring portion. I actually really enjoyed this portion a lot, but coloring in general is my favorite part of a piece of artwork, especially the shading. That's that's where I find I have a lot of fun. But yeah, so since I don't have as much to talk about for the piece itself, I guess I could talk about instead what I maybe want to do on this channel in the future. Um, you know, for now I just have a couple of speed paints, but I don't know, um, I'd like to do other things. Uh, people like stories, right? Do you guys like stories? I know there are channels that sometimes tell funny or, you know, uh, life stories or something that happened to them and set it to artwork. I don't know why you might, that might be kind of fun to try once, you know, just see how that goes. Um, or maybe I can try to find a way to make it little more interactive like a Q&A, um, you know, questions and answers. Uh, I don't know. I'll figure it out um, as I think about it more, but if anybody does have uh, suggestions or comments or opinions, feel free to comment that and uh, I will definitely consider it if you, if you write something about that. Um, Anyway, uh, right now it is just speed paints because at the moment I don't live on my own and, you know, when it, <laughs> when there are other people here, sometimes it's hard to have the house be totally empty or quiet enough to record, so I'm sorry for, you know, for now the, the activity is a little bit sparse, but I hope for that to change in the near future. Um, but yeah, I have other speed paints in mind coming up, so, you know, I don't want to be too inactive or, you know, be super scarce with how often I upload something. Um, but yeah, you know, as I figure out what I'm doing, hopefully you'll see more content. Uh, but yeah, so I am now in the shading portion of this picture. Um, I love hair, like coloring and shading hair is my life. I love doing it so much. <laughs> I don't know why, I just find it very therapeutic and, um, you know, it's fun to kind of let the lines flow um, with hair. Uh, I don't think, you know, skin is not, like, as natural. I feel like I have to work a little harder on skin to make it not so blotchy looking or, like, very harsh. But I like how it came out on this one, but, you know, it's something I still work on. Uh, shading uh, skin and even you know metal things like the gold she wears that's another thing I am trying to become better at as I practice um, yeah <laughs> sorry I'm kind of like trying to figure out what more to say just because you know I didn't I didn't have like any hiccups or anything that I could really talk about, you'll see that um, it's straightforward, but I guess I could mention that um, towards the end of the video, <laughs> I was, I, I think it was my fault, I think I forgot to hit record, you'll see kind of a bit of a jump from when I finish shading to the background, that blue background, that square background, I didn't uh, go with that as you'll see in the final result. Um, I mean, you guys are not missing much, at least, thank gosh, because all it is is just a closing out of paint tool sigh and opening it in Photoshop and changing that circle <laughs> that square into a circle and um, deleting some of the lines for the Smash Brothers logo and adding text that just says her name Zelda so 
Uh, oh yeah, and the little uh, drop shadow effect. Um, but yeah, it's not anything that's worth crying over. I mean, it sucks that I forgot to <laughs> hit play, but you know, if something was going to be missed out on, at least it wasn't the important part. So yeah, but I apologize that the ending might be a little bit abrupt from when the shading happens to the final results. It's, it's just more annoying than anything. It's nothing too insane. But yeah, I mean, for speed paints as well, I guess, you know, while I just thought about it, um, if there's anything you'd like to see, like I know so far my speed paints have both been from Zelda, but it doesn't have to be from Zelda. Um, I'm a fan of other things too, of course. Um, but yeah, if anybody has anything they'd also maybe want to see me draw or speed paint, I mean, I'm not taking requests, I can't guarantee you I'll want to do it, but if anyone has suggestions, I'll definitely take it into consideration, because I, you know, I don't mind a little variety, and, you know, I'll try to remember to do <laughs> stuff for other fandoms sometimes, that's really hard because I love Zelda games so much, it's kind of my main fandom, <laughs> so I apologize if the variety seems very heavily Zelda-based right now, because it is, <laughs> because that's, you know, I love it so much. Oh yeah, and um, for coloring, um, I think for those who just saw that I colored everything brown um, except for the eyes, it does help with the line art to not be so bold and harsh if you kind of give it a little bit of a color that isn't black. It kind of makes it for a softer appearance, so just a little you know, tidbit for those who are trying to you know work with coloring and stuff. I mean, I ain't no art professor or nothing, but, you know, <laughs> in case I can help anybody. Um, it looks like we are heading towards the end of the video. Oh, yeah, this part, I, um, you know, where I added the orange and blue for effect. That was really fun, too. Um, but yeah, so this is, <laughs> that was a, yeah, that jump was so abrupt. But yeah, this is what my final result looks like, and uh, you'll see it posted on my website. Feel free to check out the links below to find it, and uh, thank you so much for watching my speed paints, and I will see you guys later. You guys have a good one! Bye!